Welcome back. The winning streak for the Dow is over, at least for now. The major markets ended mixed yesterday with the Dow tumbling about five points. Well, the White House wants to bridge the diaper gap and make them more affordable for low income families. Our Stacey Delicat live at the NASDAQ market site in New York with that story. Stacey, good morning to you. Good morning, Andy. Happy Friday. Well, the end goal here is for the White House to give low income families access to diapers that are about 25% cheaper than market rate. Now, under the plan, the shopping website Jet.com is partnering up with the government. It will help nonprofits buy and get diapers quickly with free two day shipping. And the company Cuties has designed special packaging that cuts the cost of making those diapers. And the White House believes the program is necessary, saying that one third of families find it hard to afford diapers. The the program is going to start next month. In other news, CVS is pumping $50 million into a new anti smoking effort. This about two years after it stopped selling cigarettes and other tobacco products at its stores. The chain is going to provide funding over five years to anti tobacco and youth oriented programs. It hopes to further reduce tobacco use among young people and says the overall goal is to make today's youth the first tobacco free generation. The campaign, the latest move by CVS to boost its Image as a healthcare focused company. Andy? Yeah, you got to get creative sometimes to help people kick the habit. Stacy, thanks a lot and have a great weekend.